stop replication to students' boards. This means in real time, even when students are logged into your board, you can make edits, add and delete while they're logged in. To begin this process, you will want to go to the actions or the three dots and click the very last option, which is stop replication to students. Now, any edits I make now to the lesson will not appear on the student side. I can add different objects, gizmos, and text boxes. So I will just add a few letters for this example. I will now show a student board, which shows that the letters have not been added to their student page yet. When I am ready for students to see those letters, I will first re-enable the replication, and then I must use the lasso tool to copy any objects or text box that I have added to the page. And now if we go back to the student screen, we can see that those letters have been added in. So this is a great way to make any edits in real time, even if students are logged in, because they won't see those edits until you allow them to.